okay so let's continue our work so when the rebel is talking our player will be in the idle and when the rebel is stop talking okay then the rebel will be in the idle okay so let's select this idle animation add it right there i don't know why they add it down below add it there man come on okay so now after this add the breathing for the second rebel as well like this then we can just uh, duplicate it and then move it right here okay so the first dialogue will be for the for the rebel then the next one will be the player dialogue so now for the player let's add the talking animation let me drag and drop the player cutscene in there as you can see there he is i don't know why what happened to his hand let's add some other talking for example this one okay let's add it up there So now the player will talk like that okay and now let's cut these two and delete it then when the player talk the rebel will be listening then after this the, now the rebel will talk and the player will listen so let's add the idle unarmed let me actually duplicate this okay idle around as you can see it has moved right there okay so now the player will listen like that and the gangster will now talk okay we will add this animation so let's drag and drop it right there so it will goes like this just give us the money or we will shoot you something like that okay then uh, when the animation ends right here let's cut it and now the player will be listening to this point so let's uh, move this idle unarmed okay to this point then cut it delete it and also the rebel 2 will be not seeing anything so just duplicate the breathing idle for the rebel 2 okay and then after this point our player will just simply surrender towards the gangsters okay because this gangster too will just simply put the gun on the player okay so the player will just kneel down to them so let's go ahead and check the kneel down animation okay right here okay the player will just simply kneel down that okay okay don't shoot me or something like that so let's open this up and add the animation up there okay like this the player will kneel down okay so let's just cut that from there and then right here the scene will just simply ends but we need to change the player position okay because as you can see in kneel down in the air we don't actually want that so we need to change this position okay so from here as you can see he is on the ground now from this point okay he moved to the here so let's record this let's click on player okay and actually let me stop the recording first of all click on player like that and let me copy the component of the player then let's click on cutscene and now let's zoom in right here okay actually start recording the player transform and right here let's click on paste component values actually it is not pasting the component value so we need to do it manually okay like this whoops select the player okay actually select the player i think we paste the component 
for the cut scene if we select the player okay right here let's click on paste component values okay now as you can see it is working we just messed up everything let me just do it from the start ignore everything okay i i know this creating the cut scene is uh, a headache but just now follow me step by step let's do it manually okay when he moved to the player right here move and down below to this point then let's move forward okay move and down below like that and I think that is it now let's check it out as you can see he will be standing like that and then he will just simply kneel down like that okay so you can just work on this uh, transform of the player even more okay but I just showed you how you can change the player transform okay now when the player is kneeling down okay at this position the rebel 2 will aim the gun okay so for aiming the gun or rifle let's go ahead inside the extreme special force character animations then in here let's go inside animations again here is the rifle animations okay and this will be the animation for the rebel so we can just open this up and right here let's edit like that okay and like this the rebel will just simply aim at the player so let me just duplicate this all the way to up there okay like this so he will be aiming at the player okay and this other rebel which is the first idol he will be just simply in the idol so we can just duplicate the idol for this rebel like this that is it so now i think our whole cutscene is being created you can expand this uh, cutscene if you want okay but i will just leave this as short as i can because i have showed you how you can create your own okay so now as you can see everything is working perfectly fine i know there are some transform issues but you can just work on that and make it perfect for your own self okay i just showed you how you can create it so now as you can see this whole scene is looking perfectly fine okay now the next thing is the audio or you can say the talking or the voice so of course i have these audios for the characters okay and this is my own voice and my brother voice okay but of course i will be not providing you these voices okay you can record your own audio okay and once you have the audio then create a audio file inside the assets and in there just add all of your audios hey man some guys stole my as money as you can see okay so in this way you can just record your audios and add it to the folder inside your project and once you have the audios then i will show you how you can add audios okay so let's go ahead and where is the talking where the gangster one talks okay right here they are walking idle now here is the talking so i will be adding this audio hey what's all. in the bag show it to me okay so in order to add audio so right here click on this and then click on this audio track and now inside this audio track we will be adding all of our audios but it needs an audio source and as you know that for this game uh, I mean for this cutscene we will be having a camera as well so let's go ahead and create a camera like this okay and let's name this camera as cutscene camera and on this cutscene camera as you can see we have this audio listener for now you can just duplicate the player camera third person camera and aim camera and then this cross here okay just simply deactivate them for now okay and also deactivate the player car as well 
here it is let's deactivate that okay so make sure that you deactivate all of them and now let's click on cutscene camera here is the audio listener and through this audio listener since our camera will be around these players okay so from that camera all of the voice all voices will come okay so as you can see the audio listener is right here so now if we click on cutscene and drag and drop our cutscene camera then let's click on create audio source or on cutscene camera okay and if you click on cutscene camera as you can see it has created the audio source right there okay now let's click on the cutscene again and now let's go ahead and add the dialogues so right here we have the gangster one talks let's add this audio so now you will notice hey what's in the bag show it to me see it looks perfectly fine okay but we can just show it to me or actually let me play it again what's in the bag show it to me that's it let's just cut it from right here and remove that part now after this the player will talk so let's find the dialogue for the player okay so this second dialogue is for the player so let's drag and drop this dialogue right here and where the player start talking right here okay this dialogue will happen it's none of your business okay, as you can see it looks really good so now let's move on to the next talking session okay right here so the next dialogue will be this one so let's try and drop this when the gangsters start talking right here okay so just try and drop it now if we play it just give us the bag or we will shoot you right here right now okay now as you can see it looks fine now after this uh, the player will kneel down so right here we will be add some talking as well so this will be the dialogue for the player now so let's just try and drop it through it here and it will be like this cut it okay okay let me actually cut it right here okay remove the start and move it to this point okay okay please don't and shoot let's just cut it at the end as well okay so now in this way you can add your own audios okay so now with our animations and audios and everything added as you can see we now have a fully cut scene i know there are some issues with it still some the transform issues and the talking issues but as you know we are creating a game and i am just showing to you how you can create your own okay but if you are creating some professional game then of course you can work on this even more and make every scene of this perfectly fine okay but this is just testing so i have showed to you how you can create all of this and i hope you understand now in the next video we will continue our work on this